Hello there everybody at Vinyl Community. I have struck gold. Real CD gold. Um, I got all of these CDs for absolutely nothing. It's more than 30 CD records that I got for free. Uh, I was at a flea market here in the um, same area, in the, in the place I live here. Uh, a couple of uh, blocks down downhill, <laughs> uh, where they had um, a flea market with the uh, with the um, merely only uh, records. Uh, vinyls wasn't all that interesting. Someone has bought uh, a huge stack of vinyl, and it was uh, more or less the heavy metal left, but. Uh, then the owner had a, a huge box filled with CDs and said that I can pick, could pick uh, how many as I wanted of these CDs for free. Uh, I'm not sure that I would have done that. I would have taken at least a dollar for it because many of them were in great shape and we're not talking about the, all that much flea market stuff either. Uh, so, and I picked more than 30 records and I came home, came home with a whole lot of records and I didn't pay one single Swedish krona and it it's unbelievable. So I'm doing this special vinyl and CD update or should I say CD update uh, because if I'm going to show this in my regular one in uh, late end of July I think that one would be way too long so I think this one deserves a video of its own. Uh, so I'm going to show it uh, a whole lot of way stuff, starting from the beginning with a couple of albums that I have on a cassette copy, but that I right now I'm happy that I have in original form. Tony Braxton, Tony Braxton from '96, uh, with "Unchain My Heart." No. Uh, unbreak my heart, sorry, unchain my heart, uh, it's Joe Cocker, unbreak my heart. We have this, Pet Shop Boys, the first disco album from 1986. Uh, I have this one also on a cassette copy, now I have it on CD. Swedish singer uh, Svante Tureson. Uh, a little more of a, of a jazz slager singer. Uh, I I started to listen more and more to him. He has a great voice. Here he sings songs by uh, uh, Swedish uh, author, uh, comedian, uh, great celebrity Beppe Volgers. Jager hip baby. Swedish. Uh, Trans techno band Antiloop and their debut LP. <laughs> it is called LP even though it's a CD, which I think is part of the irony behind the title. Soul to Soul and their third album, Volume 3, Just Right. The other uh, I have have been so magnificent. I have nothing but high hopes for this one also. Eurythmics, Be Yourself Tonight. Um, would I lie to you, there must be an angel, sisters are doing it for themselves, and so on. Uh, 1985, I had this one on cassette copy. I, reco I uh, recorded it over because I thought it was so-so then. But for free I can give it another chance and, and give it a uh, new spin as an adult and see what I think of it today. Uh, this is a low budget. I have no idea what kind of musician it is here. Uh, well, uh, it says I have a feature in 
Panhu Katena Kubatstekas. I have no idea what that is. Uh, the album is called Brazil. It's some kind of a compilation of Brazilian music. I picked it only because it was for free and I like Brazilian music. Although I'm not sure how this will sound like. A compilation by Oreo Speedwagon called The Hits from 1988. I think that is just about the compilation of Oreo Speedwagon I might need. I have no clue of what I have been doing after that. Uh, speaking of compilations, The Best of Morrissey, Swadehead. Uh, I think this is uh, some kind of uh, uh, serious release uh, on, from EMI 100. But compilation with Morrissey, I couldn't resist. This one I have on, on, uh, on a copy, but I now I have it on original. Savage Garden's debut from 1987. I l really like To the Moon and Back. That is a really great song. Uh, I think the only real jazz album I, I found there, it was obviously not a jazz fan, but this one was very interesting. Dinah Washington, normally not one of my favorites, but she sings with Quincy Jones with the recording from 1955, How Can This Go Wrong, released on Giants of Jazz. A compilation of the Go-Go's. Uh, the greatest is, is from 1900 and... 90. Uh, soul group, girl band SWV, and their release some tension album from 1997. Uh, more modern SWV, so it would be interesting to see if it is just as good as the one I have from from four years earlier. Uh, on Vogue, another soul girl band but this one is a uh, very early uh, on vogue from 1990 uh, born to sing I didn't know, actually know they made album that early <laughs> uh, greatest hits of alexander o'neill i have it on cassette copy but i wanted to have it on uh, original uh, this thing called love Uh, jazz Mataz Guru. I think I have another Jazz Mataz uh, release, uh, another volume uh, hosted by Guru. Uh, this is some kind of uh, um, as a jazz, smooth jazz style that I think is really, really great. And look at the names here Shaka Khan, Ramsey Lewis. Uh, Yamiro Kwai, Donald Byrd, Freddie Hubbard, Shara Nelson. Uh, can't get any better than this, actually. Aine Kamose. <laughs> here comes the Hustapper. I hope that one is not here. Uh, Mika, Misha Paris, this one is going to be very interesting. Vam Du Project. This is uh, some kind of. Uh, I'm not sure if they're from Germany or what they are, but it is Eurodance Orchestra, uh, Eurodance band uh, from the 90s. Uh, they had one hit only with King of My Castle, Summer 99, 20 years ago. Uh, and uh, the album is called Best Of, even though this is uh, this is uh, not <laughs> this is their debut, I think. Uh, but uh, it's going to be very interesting, for free I can get, take a chance. Uh, Barry White, the icon is love, this is a late Barry White from 94, with songs among others produced by Jimmy Jam and Terry Lewis. Interesting to hear what they can do with this singer. Maxi Priest, uh, some um, little reggae style, this is from 1987. Uh, Maxi, containing his version of Wild World. Uh, Enya, Shepherd Moon. The, uh, believe it or not, this is my uh, only real studio album of, uh, of with Enya that I have. 
uh, for free I can take a chance and see what a what it sounds like. Um, Caribbean Blue is here, and I really like that song. So, so it's gonna be interesting. A compilation, Greatest Hits, Blood, Sweat, and Tears, uh, from 1972, <laughs> in a CD release. Got this for free, for fuck, for freaking free. <laughs> uh, Wilson Phillips, Shadows and Light. Uh, from 1992. I said many of these are, are stuff that I mm, don't know if I have bought, would have bought, but as for free, I can take a chance and see if I act is actually good. So I'm not sure how many of these that will actually uh, stay in the collection when I have given them spin uh, and or uh, quick peeks. Uh, hopefully, many of them. Uh, two records with soul group The Real Thing. First, this one uh, is released on a extreme low budget label called Success. I was a little bit doubtful, but since I don't have hardly anything by uh, The Real Thing, I thought, why not? Uh, it's the best of. But then, uh, further down in the in the box, I found this compilation, uh, "You to Me Are Everything," released on another uh, low budget called Spectrum Music. Uh, but uh, I think this one is even more low budget. <laughs> but um, only half of these songs are here, so there are songs here that is not on this album. So I I have to keep both of them. <laughs> Uh, two Elton John albums of modern date, 90s date. This is The One from 92. Uh, and this is Made in England from 95. I have the single Believe on the vinyl single. It's going to be very interesting to hear the full album. Uh, this was a real uh, blind pick. I had no idea what this is, but it's released on Blue Note. Uh, it's called Saint Germain, uh, and the album is called Tourist. Uh, and uh, not all that sure uh, if this might be a little bit modern, uh, but I give it a chance. It's Blue Note, and it's also free. Uh, we had trumpet, saxophone, keyboard, talking drum, percussion, baritone, saxophone, uh, or something like that. I have no idea what, what the, this actually is, but it's going to be interesting. Uh, maybe so, uh, I, uh, it, it might be some kind of a electro jazz, because I also found this, Saint German des Presse Café, Volume 3, the finest electro jazz compilation. Uh, released in 2003 uh, and since both is called St. German although this uh, uh, St. German is a band and this is the title of a compilation maybe they have something to do with each other it's going to be very interesting I picked four albums by Tower of Power for free <laughs> amazing uh, I'm not. I haven't listened all that much to Tower of Power. The, the little I've heard, I've been more impressed by uh, Blood, Foot and Tears. But since it was for free, I thought, why not? I picked them, and and uh, because I like uh, jazz rock style, I like uh, Chicago Blood, Foot and Tears style. So. It would be dumb not to pick it up and give it a chance, even though these are many of them are a bit modern. Uh, this is Monster on a Leech from 91. Sold out from 95. Uh, ain't nothing stopping us now. 
This is the oldest from 1976 in a CD release. And from 93 TOP. Amazing. I'm shocked. <laughs> uh, two albums by German band Scooter that I previous uh, have um, been not all that interesting. They have been doing uh, great songs every now and then, but I have learned to like more and more now. Uh, they are some kind of a progressive uh, techno Euro band. Uh, and uh, I'm going to. Th these are records from the period when I didn't like them all that much. They have become better now in modern times, I think. Uh, but I give it a chance, as if they were for free. Back into the heav heavyweight jam uh, from 98, consisting some great stuff that, that I consider some of the best songs they have done. Faster, Harder, Scooter, among others. And we have also We Bring the Noise from 2001. Also, this was Blind Pick. Uh, since it was for free, I thought that I'd give it a chance, even though I had never heard it. Why not take a chance when it is for free? Uh, but I listened to quick peeks of it, and I was really uh, impressed of how good it was actually so so uh, it's gonna be interesting to listen to the full uh, the full um, albums I guess some, many of you out there vinyl community know what this is and laugh at me and say haven't you haven't you heard of them <laughs> no I haven't heard of them before the poses uh, amazing disgrace from uh, 1996 and success from 1998. Uh, it's some kind of a indie rock style. Uh, I, I uh, thought it sounded like it's some kind of indie rock uh, that was really, really good. Actually, I liked the the the, uh, the, the rock style. I, I liked the, the drive and the production. I like much of this. So, so it's going to be very interesting. A lot better than I could imagine. And a few. CD singles also. Uh, the Affair. This one was a blind pick. I thought, why not? It could be something soul related. Uh, and a song called uh, If Only You Could Be Mine. The Temporer Italian Disco uh, featuring Maya and Hammer to My Heart. Really great one. And this one for free, I was really happy. The brand new heavies and You Are The Universe. Swedish rap group uh, Justia, together with Swedish dancing orchestra, dance band, dance band, Torelace. They made, made a, a song together at the uh, Swedish Gram Grammys back in 1996, uh, I think. And it became so popular that they had to release this one together. Three Gringos, Three Gringos. So it is uh, rapping with dance bands, in dance band style. <laughs> Junior Jack. Uh, I'm not sure if this is good, but I pick it up, picked it up uh, for free because it would uh, I'll see what actually if I'm wrong. But I think Uni Jack is more of a house style uh, I'm from 1999 that I'm not all that fond of, but I'm going to give it a chance. And finally, Seal, Pray for the Dying uh, from 1994, I th 91, sorry, 91. No. 94, sorry, 94. It was the uh, other tracks I opened 91. Uh, the other tracks on, on this CD. This was a mix of acoustic version of Crazy from 91. Really like this song actually, so it's great to have it on CD single. All of that for free.
amazing christmas has come early so uh, summer has been starting off when it comes to the records really really good let's hope it continues like this when it comes to the summer uh, overall the weather has been kind of sucked uh, it has been raining and it has been some chilly um, it hasn't been a kind of weather to go out on, on any kind of uh, real exploring and, and filming of great nature. Uh, hope, but I uh, only had one week so far of vacation, so hopefully it will be better uh, following weeks to come, or maybe August. Uh, so until next time, I hope that every one of you have a real nice time, no matter where you are, no matter what you do. Take care.